Hi everybody, Anime Knight here. I am back with a brand new episode of Figure Showcase Fridays, episode 87. In this 87th edition, we are going to be looking at Vegeta in his Majin form. I don't have the actual um, version. This is the only Vegeta version I have. He is the Majin Vegeta because he allowed Babidi to take over, um, over Vegeta in the Boo Saga and because he figured he could use um, Babidi's powers to bring him back to his former glory, back all the way back in the Saiyan saga. Um, real quick, the original figure was going to be um, a character from uh, Matt Cross, but unfortunately due to the shipping issues, I kind of had to switch last minute. But I did promise a Majin Vegeta episode, so here it is. Anyway, Majin Veg uh, Vegeta, he is the prince of all Saiyans, and he is the arch-rival of Goku. He is the son-in-law of both Mr. and Mrs. Brees. He is Bulma's wife, and he is also Trunks' father. And later on, um, they have a daughter, uh, what, what's, what's her, uh, Bra, I think, or... Comment below what, what his daughter's name is. I cannot remember for the life of me. I know Trunks is there. Um, uh, hell, I, I don't know. So, uh, anyway, I'm moving on. Um, he he is the... Okay, I already said that. <clears throat> he also has the big bang attack. And he comes from the... Planet Vegeta, which was um, blown up by Frieza. He served with Frieza at the time and became a henchman. And he was teamed up with Nappa to go and look for the seven Dragon Balls for Lord Frieza to grant for, for immortality at the time. And upon arrival, he, he had he, they decimated um, Tien Yamcha, Piccolo, um, and Goku at the end, because when Vegeta transforms to the big ape, he takes on Goku, and with the help of Yajirobe, he cuts off Vegeta's tail, and Vegeta reverts back to normal, thus um, <clears throat> becoming himself again. Vegeta is probably one of my favorite, probably one of my favorite pro antagonists, I guess, because he just has that like care that. That doesn't care attitude, and but he does care. He deep down he does care. He just doesn't show it from time to time. He says he doesn't like the person, but he can at least respect them. And it's shown throughout the series. He grows to be to be more accustomed to the new home, having a family, and and respecting Goku for all the accomplishments and everything. And he he was amazed when Goku turned into the legendary Super Saiyan. And on a planet, Vegeta finally snapped, and he said he didn't care anymore, thus unleashing his awakening of going Super Saiyan. Vegeta has the Big Bang attack, and uh, I want to say Final, Final Flash. Oh, it's been so long since I've seen Vegeta's moveset. Forgive me, but um, he also, um, during the Android Saga, he tricked um, Android... Uh, was it? It was Android nineteen, or it was Android nineteen, who was our also Doctor Jarrell at the time. He tricked him at the time, and and then got a Senzu Bean. He's a, a he's a tactical genius when it comes to like feigning, like provoking someone to attack him because his he claims his power is out, but it's really not. It's just a ploy, which is what I like about him. He can actually trick you into thinking he's weak, but in reality, he could still kick your ass at any time. Um, the character, the figure itself, is really amazing. I, mean, I actually love the detail. This is from the same thing I got with um, Trunks and Gohan and Majin Boots from the same series set. I like that personally. This is probably one of my favorite ones from that set because I, I just love the detail. The the eyes showing the true darkness of Vegeta, the Majin, the, the Majin symbol on his head. Um, Vegeta is an interesting character, and if you haven't gotten this, I highly recommend it. I think there might be a bigger version of this one. Also, he sacrifices himself um, 
to um, save Bulma and Trunks and from Bobbity and Majin Buu at the time because he could not keep up with, with Majin Buu. With the regeneration and the stamina of Majin Buu, it's impossible to keep up with him at the time. Anyway, guys, that will do it for this episode of Figure Showcase Writers. Oh, here's the figure one more time. Let me all know what you think. I also like the little the little electric, like the little electric bits. That's actually just so badass. Anyway, guys, that will do it for this episode. Bye!